Google Apps users can now edit Microsoft Word, Excel, and PowerPoint files directly from Google Drive, Gmail in the new Docs, Sheets, and Slides home screens without needing Microsoft Office. For Chrome OS users, there's nothing to install, it just works. Chrome users for Mac and Windows can install the Office Editing for Docs, Sheets, and Slides extension, and you're good to go. So first things first, let's go ahead and install that extension. I'm just going to go up to the top here and open a new tab. We'll just go into our Chrome store. And we're going to do a quick search. We'll just do a quick search for Office Editing. And here it is down at the bottom. You'll notice that we have Office Editing for Docs, Sheets, and Slides. If we select that one, it brings up a screen. Now I've already added this to Chrome. You'll go ahead and click on that button here and you'll go ahead and add this to your Chrome browser. So let's go ahead and just back out of that and go back to my drive. So now there's two ways that you can edit Microsoft files in your drive. The first way we can do is we can actually open a new tab. We can go into our hard drive here and I'm just going to collect a document and I'm going to drag and drop it right into that browser frame. With that Chrome extension, you'll notice at the very top there it flashed with the Chrome extension and now it says with the W here, you'll notice that it allows me to go ahead and view the document in my browser and start working with it. Now you can see up in the upper left there's my blue W. I have my four pull down menus here and then I have my bar across the top here, my toolbar, that I can go ahead and start editing something. So here it allows me to go ahead and select something. I could change the font, I could change the size, and then I can bold, unbold, and whatever. Now you'll also notice at the top here it says edits will not automatically be saved and that's because I am not in my Google account. If I go ahead and click on save now it will go ahead and save that and now I can continue working. Let's go back out of this and we're gonna go back to my drive. Now the other way that you can work within your drive and edit Office files is we can go ahead and select an actual Office file and here I have a Microsoft Word document and I'm going to double click and open that. You'll notice that Chrome extension pops up at the top here in the tab. There's my blue W here and here's my blue W here. Now previously in Drive when you would open up a document that was a Microsoft product it would open up the document and give you a view only. You wouldn't be able to modify it. It would not show this whole toolbar here and allow you to do anything with it. In the upper left corner, instead of that W, you would have seen a blue drive symbol or a grayed out drive symbol, I should say. Now, I can go ahead and select some of this text here and I can actually go ahead and start working with it. And one thing I want to point out with, as soon as I start making a change to my Word document here in my drive account, You'll notice that right next to the help, right here, it's going to go ahead and start saving all of my changes. So let's go ahead and make a change here. You'll notice that saving pops up. I can go ahead and start working with this. I can change anything that I want to in terms of text. You'll see that I've changed it here. Unfortunately, you cannot work or modify those images, so those images are kind of left there. But you can do all that you want to do to your text. So you see here that I've got that toolbar. I can do those different things that I have here. If I go up to the top left and go underneath file, you'll notice that it has Office Compatibility Mode highlighted. This just lets me know that I am in an Office Compatibility Mode. I'm not in an actual Google Doc. Now I can make a copy of this document here, and then I can also go to Save as Google Docs, and it will make a converted copy for you to start working with. Underneath Edit, I have my Undo and Redo buttons here. Underneath Format, I have my different things that you see in the toolbar in terms of bold, italic, underline, and strike through. And then underneath Health, I have my Help Center, and then I can also report an issue from here. So that's how you can go ahead and work with your Microsoft product documents within your Drive or within your Chrome browser with this new extension. Once again, that extension is called Office Editing for Docs, Sheets, and Slides, and you'll find that in the Chrome Web Store. And one last word of advice, just letting you know that this only works within your drive in the new drive interface. So once you've got that rolled out to your domain, you can go ahead and utilize this from within your drive.